honestly, if I were to suggest printers for people to start with today, I've, I've been watching a lot of videos on printers recently. I, I feel like you should just jump to like modern hardware. You should jump straight to like the uh, Bamboo Labs A1 Mini or A1. And guess what printer has started catching fire? Hello everybody. Uh, very important, if you ended up buying one of these uh, Bamboo Lab A1 printers, send it back. There is a problem with the back side of the printer uh, where the bed cable attaches. Let me see if I, they have a product photo including it. This cable right here. Um, there is a combination of either common user handling or um, manufacturing defects that causes this cable to become unstable, start sparking, and become a fire hazard. They've issued a... They're not calling it a recall, but it's a recall. They're issuing a recall for this printer where uh, there's an option to either return your printer and uh, get a new one or equal value trade-in uh, towards a new printer. Like if you wanted to get... They, I read the page. It listed everything, pretty much everything, on their entire uh, model lineup. Uh, I saw this on a Loyal Moses video. That is not... First off, I don't follow a lot of people in the 3D printer space. This guy has been pretty helpful lately. Um, so yeah, give him a follow for whatever that's worth. Okay. So here we have the A1 recall update. Um, oh, callback is what they're calling it. I'm like to, but it says recall at the top. So whatever. Um, but. I will link this below to where if you have one of these, you can check it and see what you want to do. But I also wanted to post this because I wanted to be sure that no one saw a good deal on an A1, like at a cheap price for, from the secondhand market and said, I need that. I feel like... There is some level of responsibility I have for whenever I make a recommendation uh, to put out updates whenever uh, there have been important updates for safety. If like a feature wasn't as promised or whatever, I feel like if there's important caveats for me to bring up, I should. So. It took me way too long to make this for a million reasons, including my voice sounding horrible because my spray paint mask does not fit my face. And I also think it just doesn't work. It doesn't hold the filters in place. So I got a throat full of spray paint. Anyways, please do not buy a Bamboo Labs A1 until after they have made changes and do a re-release. They, they will probably do that, that. Please do not buy an A1 until the re-release has been issued. Uh, you want to make sure that uh, machines that produce heat and move molten material for sometimes days on end are safe. They need to be electrically sound and they need to be durable. This, I feel like this could be fixed with just a simple drag chain and like something to protect 
the plug over here. You know, something to reinforce right there and up there. Because if you see, it's not, it doesn't have like the thick part of most charge cables, charging cables that like they have like a little bit of grace area where it's just like a little extra thickness to protect it from bending too tightly. So, please stay safe, be vigilant and informed when you're making uh, purchasing decisions. I still want one of these things. I've got to wait till the re-release. Or maybe by the, that time, I'll have saved up enough for like a P1P or something. Because, I don't know, getting a Core XY would probably be, probably yield much better results than bed slingers. Regardless, thank you so much for watching. Um, I'm probably not going to do a whole lot of cutting on this video. I'm not going to add music or anything. I just want to get it out of Premiere and get it to y'all in a timely manner. Because I've already drugged my feet for too long, wondering, should I do this? Should I not? Should I wait for my voice to recover? I should have just made it immediately. But thank you, everybody, so much for watching. Next time I put out a video, it will be because a project I've made has come to fruition, not because some product recommendation I made based off of vibes and research went south. So stay tuned for that. I don't know, you can click some other videos or something. I really don't have anything else for you, you know. You can just click off, go back to watching Ludwig or Tiny Meat Gang or whatever whatever it is your jam is these days. Traitors. Watching other content creators cheating on me. Alright, for real. Bye.